Hey guys, here's a quick little weekly walkabout. Let's get a zip around and show you some cool stuff I've got to sell this week. Great little fun ho, New Zealand diecast Caltex tanker. Great little bit. There's lots of lovely little Beatrix Potter figurines, all Beswick and things like that. A couple of them laying down flat there. Really like this little 19 sort of 30s bathing girl there riding the dolphin. It's got a chip out of the tail, unfortunately, but she's very cool. Some nice footy cards, the mobile footy fan photos and heaps of signed ones up the top there. Some more heaps of nice little lots of the Beatrix Potter figures. There you go, lots of them over here, little bunnikins one there as well and some old coins. And these are lovely little mother of pearl um, little miniature guitars. Some nice stuff in the jewellery cabinet. We've got some lovely furniture and stuff this week, lovely little cedar hall table there. Lovely fold up campaign chair, we've got a few of them in the sale, another one up on top there. Nice little display cabinet. Kind of like this little rocking chair. He's a lovely little one as well. Another nice fold-up campaign chair. Another lovely little cedar table. And it's another nice little display cabinet. The Planet Lamp's a ripper. Nice little box lot there of old aluminium 1950s um, Delaware English aluminium cooking set there. Unusual shape and everything. Cool little lot. Um, I've got lots of nice box lots and things this week as well, guys. Some cool retro lighting. Some cool kids toys, nice stereo equipment, books, bottles, etc. Lots of cool stuff. Nice little Art Deco standard lamp there. We've got some more clothes to get through as well on the rack. Cool little doll's house over the back there with all the furniture in it. We've got some nice sort of ladies clothing and accessories and boxes this week that couldn't fit on the rack. We've got some lovely books also this week. Some nice reference book, Modern Ceramics to Lures Le Trek. There you go, some Australian thoroughbred stats and stud stuff. Some Australiana books, history of Moorabbin, etc. Nice jewellery reference books. Got lots of pretty china and tins and books and stuff this week as well. There you go, some nice stuff, nice big lots of tins and big, big heaps of costume jewellery. Some great little stuff in this box as well, actually. Little feathers and other sort of ladies' adornments and things. We've got about four different typewriters all in their boxes this week. A couple of cool red ones and stuff like that. Heaps of die casts in the box. Some cool guitar effects pedals there. The Boss little twin pedal there is pretty cool. Got some nice paintings and prints. This Roth print's quite a nice bit of 1950s, 60s. Really like this little Louis McCubbin oil painting, actually. Fred Sun, he was a war artist. It's a really nice little example of his work. Signed lower right, L. McCubbin. There you go, it's a lovely little oil. Nice uh, chromolithograph as well, actually. This one's a lovely bit in its original frame. We shall be wanted yet, it is called. And the horses are looking on to the early automobile that has broken down. So there you go, the horses are still wanted. Very cool little chromolithograph, lovely bit. Some nice little sort of retro tub chairs and a purple frame plastic mirror is pretty cool. Got some cow skin rugs, one big one there, and we've got three or four little ones over in that pile. And you go, we've got some brand new Reebok runners down the bottom there. Some nice big lots of EP and crystal and china. Some other stuffs. Big Norwegian flag. Nice little crybaby wah wah pedal in amongst there. This is pretty cool as well, the original Batman cape. Pretty damn cool cowboy boots. Giddy up. What else have we got? Samovar, camera gear, some great old posters. A couple of crucifixes are nice, a little jewellery box in their contents, some nice little retro kitchen stuff, some other kitchen alia. All nice boxes of old comics and ephemera. This little radio is a bit interesting with a mottled um, little Bakelite front on it there. Nice pair of old bank scales. Yeah, some cool stuff this week guys. More brand new Nike shoes, Air Max in there. The old Capsella sets are pretty cool as well, I used to have them when I was a kid. What else have we got? We've got some nice retro stuff in the couple of end cabinets. The yellow mushroom lamp's cool. The big Japanese cookie jar. Nice lots of canisters and this little sort of eyeball clock's pretty cool as well. I really like this bit of Gustavsberg, the Swedish 1970s designer piece. Some more nice retro stuff over the back. Nice big charger. He's a bit different. No marks on it, unfortunately, but it's an interesting bit. And the nice little lot of retro stuff. The Gunda vase over the back's a bit damaged, unfortunately. There we go, we've got some lovely big, this big um, Victorian art pottery was a vase that someone's converted into a lamp. Uh, it's a little bit damaged, but it's a pretty amazing piece. Speaking of pretty amazing, how cool are the, 
Mickey Mouse and Donald Duck rubber masks from the 1970s. Some lovely bits of china and glass and stuff this week also. Some nice bits of carnival glass, the melon rib vases. I like this West German charger made by um, Hoa. Over the back there, it's got all the marks. Looks like the moon surface or something. And this is cool, the Balneric, Balnearing Picnic Races. Lady Brooks Easter Cup 1976 won by Anna Star. There you go. Would you guys believe I used to have a racehorse? And he ran twice in one day at Balnearing once. He did nothing both races as well. <laughs> anyway, some more cool stuff. A little nice little lady had vase and some nice art reference books. Australian Cubism, George Bell School. Nice Olympics tin there and some Royal Albert trios. Some other pretty china and pottery. And the top shelf, we've got some lovely stuff there. Little Royal Winton Hazel Pattern Part Breakfast Set. It's just missing the toast rack. Lovely Claris Cliff salad strainer there with a bowl of the matching saucer. Beautiful little early lot of Wedgwood Jasper ware. Another nice little lady had vase as well. And the Diana lamp over the back there just needs the workings in. It's got the shade for it. And how cool is the Japanese piggy set? <laughs> really cool. Really like it. Everyone likes a fat round little oinker. Anyway, hopefully you saw something you liked. You know the score if you didn't, bad luck. Won't find anything for you next week. Heh. <laughs>